collecting 10 small clams makes one power clam. We all know that. Did you know why the big clam is called a power clam and not something else like a clam ball? This game mode has been out for 4 months and people still don't seem to know how it works. I hope these 3 facts clear up things a little bit and help you enjoy this game mode a bit more. 1. How fast does a dropped clam disappear? We all know that after tossing or dropping a clam, they disappear. If you didn't know that, now you do. But did you know how long it takes for these clams to go away? Using my video editing software, I was able to time exactly how long it took for a clam to break after it's dropped on the ground. In the case of a clam being thrown, I measured the duration from the frame in which the throwing process begins. I did the same for clams dropped while splatted, starting from the frame in which the clams appear on the screen. In both cases, it takes exactly 10 seconds. Speaking of dropping clams, 2. How many clams do you drop when you get splatted? Well that's simple. You drop as many clams as you were holding, right? Wrong. Kind of. The number of clams you were holding before you got splatted is pretty important when it comes to this one. Let's suppose you're writing a really important email. Wait no, let's suppose you're carrying one clam and then you get splatted. How many clams do you drop? One. Okay, but what if you're carrying two clams? Two. Simple enough. Three clams? Three? That ain't Trico. How about four clams? Three. Five clams? Three again. Six clams. Still three. And at seven or more, you only drop four clams. Here's a nice chart for you. Now that you're bored out of your mind, let's get to the juicy bit. Three. Why is it called a power clam? Have you ever wondered why this thing is called a power clam and not something cooler like a clam ball? You dumb teach. It's because it has the power to break the anime barrier. Thanks for the clickbait. Um, actually, I think it's called the power clam because it has a special power. Some people probably already knew the previous two things. But did you know the power clam's secret ability? And no, I'm not talking about the fact that it shows up on everyone's map and reveals your location. The power clam is more of a double-edged sword. You see, while your team holds a power clam, you and all of your teammates will slowly charge your special. That's right! Holding a power clam will charge your special. Granted, if you aren't doing anything, it takes 56 seconds to go from empty to fully charged, but you shouldn't be standing around doing nothing for almost a minute during a match. There are a lot more game mechanics involved when it comes to power clams and charging your special. I'll make a video covering them soon. So, did you already know all three of the facts? Is there anything else you're curious about in this game? Let me know in the comments below. And thank you for watching. I will see you next time.